Thanks for tuning in to Let's Talk About It Media 21. I hope you're having a great day. Stay positive, stay focused. Let's get to it. What is the hot topic that's going on on YouTube or Instagram? Copyright disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act of 1976, allowance is made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comma, comments, comma, news reporting, comma, teaching, comma, scholarships and research. Fair use is use permitted by copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. All comments are alleged in our opinion and for entertainment purposes only. Don't forget the cash app is Let's Talk About It Media. Thank you for all your love and support. So don't forget to like, to comment, but be kind. If you don't want to leave a comment, that's fine. You could always leave a heart, a thumbs up, a rose, a flower. Any and everything helps with the algorithm. So let's get to it. As we know, Travis dated Ben Barry is her last name. And they dated in like 2016. Why is she even talking, though? Now that I think about it, I thought they just broke up last year. They broke up in 2016, and of course, okay, he cheated. Guys do grow, they do learn. That was a long time ago. But I guess people have comments for her. Taylor Swift fans are calling her out, feeling away. We're going to go through the clip, and then let me know in the comments how you feel about her speaking out. She thought that they had a future together. That was a long time ago. He's moved on. He's probably dated people in between. And did she say something then when he was dating somebody? Maybe a year ago, two years ago. But it's just because it's Taylor. She's trending with Taylor and she's trending with him. This is the biggest thing. Everybody like clickbait. I don't do the clickbait. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you what it is. So I guess she wanted to trend because he she did date him. But... That was 2016. And her biggest thing is that she was trying to give Taylor a warning. We get it. People aren't happy about her warnings, though. And it's not okay to say learned about his crazy stuff to people. Social media. And now she says she's not sure if Kelsey's romance with Taylor Swift is for real. The only reason that I question the genuineness of the relationship is because he's talking to the media a lot. Maya says she's been getting death threats from Swifties who think she's trying to destroy the budding romance. How do Swifties react to you? Swifties are aggressive, very negative, very hypocritical. It's really crazy to me that someone that I think is, you know, positive and really nice has such a negative and angry fan base. How do you feel about Taylor Swift? I don't know Taylor Swift, but I'm a fan of her music. You know, I don't feel any way about her dating Travis. It's cute. I mean, I had him first, so. The narrative is you're a bitter ex-girlfriend who's out for her 15 minutes of fame. How do you feel about that? I'm offended because five years ago when I said the allegations about cheating and when I talked about that we were together for eight months, his camp and team and even himself he didn't say anything about it i do feel a way because i did like you i felt like i fell in love with you it's nothing about taylor it's more about you led me to believe that we had a future and now five years later you're laughing and now i feel like you're mocking me i'm not jealous or bitter about taylor she's beautiful she's successful we're in two different lanes my issue is more with travis in the sense of now you're trying to turn me into I don't know, a bitter person or a liar, like I'm delusional, and I'm the furthest thing from that. Well, we reached out to Travis Kelsey for his comment about that cheating allegation. And this is the biggest thing. That was five, six years ago. People move on. They revolve. You know, they evolve. You know, maybe he did cheat. Maybe it was a situationship. But then people are trying to make it in regards to leveling up they're trying to make it a culture thing it has nothing to do with culture people lie people cheat look at tristan he's cheating on chloe every month i mean every year allegedly tristan cheated on chloe almost every year they dated people cheat people lie it doesn't make it okay but the biggest thing is we get why she spoke we get it you know, people are trying to call her bitter. She thought they had a future, but she didn't. Men from, you know, different sports grow, they learn, they move around, they travel a lot. 
I'm not making excuses. This has nothing to do with culture. It doesn't. And then her saying something about he's enjoying all the media. Well, he should. <laughs> She's one of the biggest stars and he's trending. So, and he looks happy. So what wishes in regards to the situation? I just thought I'd do a video about it. I'm not mad at sister girl. She's gorgeous. Just move on, move forward. If he cheated, hopefully you get a man that won't cheat. Sometimes men are interesting because he cheated. She might get with somebody else that also is going to cheat on her because you put up with it. You thought y'all had a future. Well, if he cheated, you didn't think y'all had a future because he didn't see a future with you if he was cheating. You understand what I'm saying? We talk about healthy, safe relationship. Everybody's gone through something in a relationship. Some women trust men. Some women don't. Some women got check phones. Some women got to do a bunch of stuff. Mm -mm. Some women don't even want to be bothered. Be loving, kind, be respectful, be committed, be loyal, be exclusive. And if you don't want to do that, go right over there. Some women don't even put up with that. But well wishes. Let me know in the comments how you feel about this whole Travis, Taylor Swift, Miss Benberry situation. We get why she's speaking out, but it's sad that Taylor Swift fans are just as bad as some, some of the other people's fans. And I would say that these, these people that are famous and celebrities, they need to talk with their fans. Look at here. We're not going to do anything not positive. We're not going to be sending any kind of unwelcoming comments to people. I don't understand why some of these celebrities don't speak up. And have they? I know Selena do. Selena don't play. Selena will say, let's be kind. Let's move forward. Well wishes. Let me know in the comments how you feel about the subject. And in regards to him and Taylor dating, will it last under five years? Will it last under eight years? Let's see what happens. Well wishes to Taylor. She is a huge star. I was watching a show and many people were saying with her dating him, the K's and the J's were looking for that media attention and they're not getting it. So it's, it's, it's interesting how Taylor is dating him. Kim announcement about dating Ocho. I'm not, not Ocho. Uh, Odell Beckham did not trend like this is trending. Well wishes. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the channel. Like, comment, and subscribe.